Good evening. This is a short video to demonstrate how to enter the parameter settings on an Evo home controller and to make changes to the cycle rate and minimum runtime. So first of all, wake the screen up and go into installer settings by holding settings down and then click to ignore the warning. Then we've got the um, different tiles in the installation menu. So you'll have used these before, um, guided config, add a zone. Zone config uh, gets you into edit the zone, um, system summary and system devices gives you the overview. Um, but this video is looking at the system parameters. So if we open system, system parameters, we've got several parameters that we can change. One is uh, sensor offset, um, then we've got cycle rate, runtime, fail safe and stored up water. Uh, and, and this one we're going to look at the cycle rate and minimum runtime. So to make a change you select the uh, relevant parameter and then uh, you've got a uh, up and down arrow to change the, the cycles and at the bottom you've got a question mark. Question mark is your contact sensitive help. So in this case, this is telling you uh, about how the cycle rate is set um, and really it's giving you a, a clue really there to uh, go away and consult the, the boiler manufacturers or, or do some other background reading. Um, so we're going to uh, make a change here. Um, at the moment it's uh, set at six cycles an hour um, for an oil boiler. Uh, we're going to reduce that down to three. Um, to accept you, you press the tick. So it's now changed from six cycles now to three. Then looking at the minimum on time, again touch it again. Question mark gives you your guidance. Yeah, so it's basically saying uh, minimum on time is, is setting the minimum run of the boiler um, so that it doesn't short cycle. And uh, you can run it for a minimum amount of time. This is important on on things like oil boilers and, and heat pumps. So for this example we're going to set it to 4. And press accept. And then we've got our, got our settings there. And to, um, to save those settings you just go and press the, the top left. And that gets you back to your home screen. So that's tonight's short video.